curiosity killed the cat. Now surely you have felt the feeling of being so curious that you must find the answer at any costs. The important lesson learned in this story says that some things are best left alone. Is this a good spot? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wherever you feel comfortable. Okay. Um, I, I think I think I'm ready then. Great. Let's get started. Um, I don't really know where to start. Okay. Well, why don't you describe the house? Okay. Um, it it was a rundown old thing. It wasn't far from my grandparents' farm, and it had been abandoned for years. We were never allowed to go in there. Why? What happened there? Um, well, the story was that this family lived in there and the father lost his mind. He killed his entire family with, with a butcher knife and then committed suicide. Grandma thought it was a far-fetched story, but Grandpa had been in there before and he never said, a word about it and he was absolutely persistent about us not going in there well what made you go in I mean you had enough warning well I know I wasn't supposed to but it was childish curiosity I suppose what happened in there well the first thing we noticed was the temperature change it was a hot August day, and stepping into the house was like walking into a freezer. And as decrepit as it was on the outside, it was ten times worse on the inside. And bats and birds had been roosting in there for years, probably. The first strange thing was the breeze. I mean... It was an old house, so we were expecting it to be drafty, but this was so much worse than just a draft. And it seemed to be coming from the house itself. I couldn't explain it. As we were walking up the stairs, it seemed the attic was creating the cold air coming down at us. My brother wanted to explore the second floor, but I knew I didn't want to. All of a sudden, there was a knocking coming from inside the walls. It was as if something was trying to bust out. And then, all of a sudden, the door started opening and closing by itself. Did you see that? I didn't if you didn't. Okay, well, maybe we should finish for the night. No! We need to finish what we started. Okay, so the door was opening and closing. And then it stopped. At that point, I just wanted to go home, but my, my, my brother wanted to keep going. And then a really bright light started seeping through the cracks of the door. And then the door started banging and scratching it. 